I would say I am a stream of consciousness composer. Usually the first idea that I have is the one that I do. I usually sit and play and just think about my day as if you were to sit down and write in your diary. I love this idea that people ask me like, so does music like, like is it freeing, is it relaxing? Not always for me. Sometimes making music like in my room can be very stressful and draining. The experiences from day to day can be completely different emotionally and I expect them to. Hi, my name is Kiefer and this is for Majestic Journal. I've been playing piano since I was very little. My dad started teaching me things when I was about four or five. And then my mom started teaching me how to read when I was like six or seven. Usually I wake up around nine and then I usually have a student from 10 to 11 and then one 11 to noon. That's, Ooh, you think that's this is gonna be hard? Yes, but that's not gonna deter us. <laughs> it really helps me reinforce concepts that I like to utilize in my own musicianship. So we're keeping Oscar's rhythmic phrasing, which is what I think is really strong there, but we're just trying some different melodic options. I think people perceive jazz a certain way. For me, jazz is as much a sound as it is a language. All because you don't understand a certain type of music doesn't mean you can say that it's bad, you know? It's like, yeah, he, he totally did that on purpose, Tom. You're such a ham, you're a ham. Oh, nice. John and Paul, dude. Hey. Funny running into you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Every day, dude. There's a few cool shirts. It's a little red, white, and blue joint. Kind of cool. I got this one like last week. I really like this one. I like to button them all the way up. Just a kicking it shirt. So yeah, this was my favorite, but now it's been retired. I can't really wear it anymore. Because that just that's just weird. Yo, should we actually maybe oh man. Play basketball. Oh god. That ball is flat as hell, huh? Ready? Oh, not a bad start. Love. Basketball, I love watching basketball. I don't really play anymore, but I love basketball. Honestly, I take a lot of influence from many basketball players. Who, what player would I be? Oh, this is so tough. Uh, Dennis Rodman, dude. But not in terms of his personality, but in terms of just effort, you know? You always gotta try a crazy shot. I'm gonna try a half court shot, like walking into it. Maybe not the most skilled guy out there, oh. but smart and plays hard. Oh. 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 Oh, terrible. Oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. There we go. <gasps> nice. Just going out there, but putting everything you have into it and letting your emotion drive you, you know? Just like. There you go. First try. Ready for this? Oh, my God. job as a musician is to find beauty and to display it. I want people to listen to music and be like, wow, like, you know, this is a really beautiful life. Like, that's what I want the response to be. See, I used to have panic disorder, which is where your fear of having a panic attack can cause you to have one. And it causes this feedback loop that can last a long time and in my case it lasted about a year and so the first thing that I learned to do was just be okay with that initial anxiety and not judge it at all. It's actually related to this thing I was saying earlier to my student. A mistake is when you don't know what to do with what you just did. I think like when you have anxiety your initial thought can be oh this is bad 
but I've like taken on the responsibility to let people know like it's very, it's something you can work on. And if you don't believe it's gonna get better, then it's probably gonna be a little harder. So I think it's really good to like go in with that positive attitude. Be encouraged and encourage others. That's the mantra. That's what I like live by now in my like musical and personal life, yeah. Just trying to do things the right way trying to be encouraging, trying to dedicate myself to the discipline of music itself. Yeah, I just want people to feel good and feel positive about the lives that they live, you know?